if you're like a really true creative visceral vibey type person it's probably hard for you to work at a corporation so how can you give a creative you know creative ideas and you're working in, in a house of non-create and non-creative it's like that it feels like real <clears throat> i don't know just yay apple steve jobs type music you know like like i'm gonna change the world i'm gonna make it i'm gonna make people's lives better on some post steve jobs howard hughes type shit Well, that's what we're gonna do. That's what we're in the plans of. Yeah, I, I, I have no, <laughs> yeah, I have no, um, I have no, I, I'm 100% gonna be like a multi, multi, multi billionaire. I just well, think, yeah. I think it's fun <laughs> that I can like be like Charlie Sheen and be like, hey, like I got AIDS, you know, like that to me, like I told Drake that the other night. I was like, yo, Drake, I'm in personal debt. And to me, for me to tell Drake the fucking number one bachelor in the world that could fucking wrap anybody into a trash can that lives four blocks down the street from my wife and like basically fucks all of her friends that I'm in personal debt is such a like putting down the sword or putting down the hand or opening showing the hand that I don't have my poker face on with any of you guys. I'm just me. You know, I'm just a creative, you know, everything I did, even when it was missed time, whatever, it might have been from a, you know, it's always like from a good place and I know that I'll overcome it and I know that the world will overcome it because like I'm gonna change the world I'm gonna make it I'm gonna make people's lives better on some post Steve Jobs Howard Hughes type shit like I'm gonna do things with education I'm gonna do things that help to calm down mur uh, murders in Chicago or across the globe things to help down to calm down police brutality to, to equalize the wealth meets the class system because there's a bunch of classes wealthy people that hate Obama because he's more social and he wants the people who don't have anything to have everything and my in my little way by learning how to design design is something that's only given to the rich currently the exact color palette that Hermes uses versus the color palette that forever 21 uses a color palette is extremely important color is important you know, the, the knowledge of proportions, you know, the size of our house versus the size of someone else's houses and just the dynamics of the proportion. Like, I don't want this conversation to go too, too long, but I wanted to give you a bit of like where I'm at, the perspective that I'm at and the way, the fact that I am the microprocessor of our culture, meaning like I can figure out how to give Rihanna a Margiela, I mean, a, a Mary J. Blige type album i can figure out how to get the fashion world to accept my wife and thus the whole family i can yeah. figure out i can figure out those are i can figure out a lot of impossible i can figure out how to make something that you're wearing to the airport five years after the entire globe was like hang that nigger alive and 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 fucking yeah. and let's watch him die slowly publicly his you know so it's a lot, I figured that out for myself, so it's a lot of shit that we collectively with the power that you have and your fans, the power my wife has, the power that I have, that we can do to really make it where it's not just the rich getting richer, but, you know, you know, make it not just a fucking charity, not singing for Africa, change things in a way that people can, can experience shit themselves, a piece of the good life, you know? Yeah.